Hello, cadets. I'm back here for all of you. How are you? I am fine. It's a glorious morning. The birds are chirping. People oh, are walking. And it's mornings like this. We love to enjoy the game and play a power world. So, we're going to put these uh, blue balls up. <laughs> ah, blue balls jokes. Uh, let's see here. And, and we're going to sort. So, we got more rockets. And we're going to use these for one reason. We're going to the next boss area. So let's see our past travel. Time to take down the tour up. Popo. The evil cops. Let's enforce justice. <laughs> no, I'm not. I love voice acting, so let's get started. Hold on. There we go. We got a rocket launcher. I put it back in the spear. I I I I, I uh I released it prematurely on accident. Ah, uh, sex jokes prematurely release. Ah! Maybe it's a little bit early for that, but oh well. You missed a hole. Try again for a zinny. Come on, come on. Really yep. I can be too, but uh, two targets to deal with at the same time are a lot more difficult than one. I've got plenty more rockets there, fella. <laughs> Took down my shield. Fuel barrel roll. That's <laughs> Mm-hmm.
Oh, that was a critical hit. Nice. Miss that rocket. Nice. Don't, don't, don't. Another one takes the dump. Don't, 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 don't. Another one goes out in the dumpster. That was lit works. Yeah, it was. Probably. We don't, well, never know. Probably for a good reason. Oh, you're nah, I'm feeding him because he's hungry. Going to our local city. You finally got revenge on that guy. In my older game, like, we couldn't beat him. But today, we beat him, cadets. Listen to me. Nah, I just woke up fresh and perky. <laughs> eh, I got nothing to sell, really. Let's see here. Hopefully a supply drop or a meteor hits soon. Otherwise, this is going to get rather dull. Hmm. So we got that reason to deal with. So we got one boss, two boss, three boss, four boss. We got the first one right here. We got six one right here. And we got two more bosses to go. Holy hell. Science Institute and the new Shokuma region. But I want to save the Shokuma region for, like, obviously. Yeah. 
I want to save the Shokuma region until we get to level 55. Or at least we get the laser rifle. That'd be nice. So as of right now, uh, we're going to head over to... Uh... Hmm. I did not know there was a green energy we were missing over there. All the way up there is one of those uh, leafy mon energies. All the way up there. Holy crap. What happened here? Okay. And fiber. We don't need the fiber though. So I'll take the wood. Wonder if that was from an earlier gameplay when I didn't pick up the wood. Interesting how that carries over like that. Yep. Just got to get a good angle on it. Nah, so I don't have to spend much energy climbing. Because there is a health bar for climbing and jumping and stuff and running. Well, it's more like a stamina bar, but... Yeah, glide her down, yeah. Let's glide her down. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Uh. yeah, that's a lot out of wood that I blew up with the rocket launcher previously. No, I can't remember when I did it, but I did it. The rocket launcher does do a lot of collateral damage. Do love me some collateral damage sometimes, especially when it helps me with my inventory. And... Yep, steps glitched out there. Very funny. There's a place here with four chests I want to go to. Usually some good schematics there every once in a while. Gonna need as many of those schematics as possible for the Minotaur's challenge. Prizes. Oh, please stay down. No, it escaped because the spear wasn't good enough. Level 38 means we need ultra spears. There's that spire. That's right. Let's see. A, which one's it? Time to time, yep. 
that's me. So far, no. Huh. Okay, the chest did not spawn. That's a crying shame. It's been a while since. I bet it's just a graphical glitch in the game. Something that happen every once in a while. Probably gonna be a while before this chest res. So let's just try I to find a cave to spawn in for now for some loot. I do love me some looting and shooting. Yeah, or in this case, Pal World. <laughs> and let's see here. Ah, oh, Bob Man. I'm gonna blow it up. Yep. Take its meat. Yeah. It's a freaking rocket launcher. What do you expect it, for it to fizzle out? Yeah. <laughs> no, that cave's gone. <laughs> Screw you. It explodes with tremendous force. It ain't gonna do one damage, Joey. Uh. It'd be funny though. Probably Yeah, that's the dollar store brand right there. <laughs> Or the 99P store brand. <laughs> if that's the case, like, it's not worth crafting in the first place if it's like that. <laughs> I'll be like, what the fuck? What am I doing with a 99P store rocket launcher? Talking about a pea shooter? Yeah, this thing is worth one yen per per. That's like I think that's like one. Yeah, Japanese yen. <laughs> yeah, I forget what the exact currency is, but it's like a lot, lot. Yeah. And my cell phone went off again. Somebody contacted me on Facebook. What the heck? I literally don't like putting up with Facebook much anymore. There's a VTuber. It's a cancerous shithole. Even more so than Twitter. Also, it's kind of outdated for, like, VTubers. Yeah, I have that schematic, but another one won't hurt. Much of this is possible. I'm going to need for, a lot, like, the Minotaur's Challenge of Pal World that I'm planning to do in the next couple of months. I'm also going to have to try uh, to do Google old Forums page for obviously contestants I 
don't know how much doing Google Forums cost. Because I want this contest to be as legit as possible. Like, oh, people put in a Google Forum uh, request and, like, obviously, either in the system to possibly be in the contest. Well, not contest, but a challenge. So I'll probably take on like three people in the challenge at a time. Yeah, like per live stream, like three people in the challenge at a time. And like amongst the three, whoever does the most damage would probably walk away with or uh, beats me in the most efficient way or impressive. Would probably walk away with the biggest prize, and it's a couple of legendary schematics. And, and probably like a decent amount of gold once I start like finding a way to like mine for like gold. Uh, in this game, it's currency, so that'll be interesting to try to get a whole bunch of that. Without needing to spin it on ammo all the time. And food, vision, so. But despite all that, like. Decent amount of gold and a couple of legendary schematics. As prizes for like beating the uh, Minotaur's challenge in Power World of mine I got planned. But, uh, yeah, so that's something I'm actually looking forward to, that I actually want to do. That is a big egg. Mine! Not yours. You didn't lay it. No, but I'm gonna hatch it. Yes, I stole it from its parents. What's going to do after they left it alone? They abandoned the egg, so I'm repossessing it. Then when you don't know, they might come back to you. And they'd be like, what happened to my baby? <laughs> That's a very cute. They fly out. They get... Yeah, well... Pokemon lay eggs, like Pokemon in a way. Uh -huh. So, like, it's not just birds in Pal World. It's like all Palmon do that. But clearly, it was his. All the eggs in Pal World are in a nest? <laughs> and there's another big egg. I wonder how big of an omelet I can make from that if I ever, if they ever allow it. Oh. No. This is a doge. One of the Palmon that uh, pretend to be a chest. No legendaries. Ah, well, I accidentally killed it. Oh, look at all that gold. That's a lot of gold you get from those things, just putting them down like that. Yep. Yes. And it takes X. I like to reload the gun now. Crap pile. Good. Free crap. Five shotgun shells. We take those. 
I'm assuming we got a decent amount on um, Doge coins, but not enough for what I want to get. From those guys you find in the churches, the Powell churches, so yeah. No, uh, they got a merchant there that takes those dog coins. They're the only ones that take the dog coins. You can find them in these uh, broken down chapels. And you're able to get items that you normally can't get on your own. I need to get like, I think it was 10,000 dog coins for uh, one specific item that allows you to have a fourth accessory equipped. With the current update, you know? Rain Orcs do again. Got a Hyper Spear. Not bad, not bad. It should be a teleport point this way. Yeah, that's a teleport point. Gotta be careful the energy because like I'll run out. Yeah, the more or better glider better belt glider you have, the more control you have over our gliding. So and it, the quicker you can pull I so right now, what we're gonna do is, there is a church right here. <laughs> Desolate church. Joey doesn't know what this um, church merchant looks like. But uh, yeah, so this is the church merchant. He's the guy that literally buys the Pa'al uh, coins. Yeah, he's literally a retrain of the black market dealer. So, what I want to get is this. This allows you to have a fourth accessory. But it takes 1,000 coins. I have 429. Like, the fruits here increases uh, Palmon's capabilities. But this is an all-purpose fruit thing. Like, it it upgrades all the Palamon stats and features. And unlocks their true potential. Like, that's 2,000. Yeah, you gotta collect, like, 2,000 of those. I might as well see if I can upgrade my stats here. No, I need. Yeah, I need four more leafy mining energy before I upgrade my capture rate. That's unfortunate. But not unexpected. <laughs> Free pork. Yep. Guys, give up bacon. Yep. Mm-hmm. And that one gives up free beef and berries. And there's two. <laughs> yep. Blast radius be a thing. I have no mellow when it comes to the rocket launcher. Oh, look, it's a syndicate bitch. <laughs> Trying to put a cap in your ass. <laughs> With a stick. At level three. And it beats.
Nah, not an ugly stick. More than likely to as a kid's toy from McDonald's menu. He's trying to beat me with a, a, the McDonald's toy. Only to figure out as soon as he hits it with against me, it's like it's gonna break. And he goes like, my Happy Meal toy, no! You broke my new Happy Meal toy. <laughs> yeah, that's instead of getting uh, to how strong I am. <laughs> A level three to a level forty nine. <laughs> like what the fuck? Of course your toy's gonna break. Uh, let's see here. Uh oh. I got a rumbly in my tumbly. Satisfied with some berries. Let's see here. No, I don't need any of those right now. Those blue rocks. But I am looking for food to cook, so might as well just keep going on the hunt. If y'all were here earlier, obviously, a -E, heads up. We already took on um, the police syndicate leader. That was fun. Retribution. <laughs> I am vengeance. I am the knight. I am Commander D. Can you blame me? He's so iconic. Joey Batman's just literally so iconic. Ah, oh, we're gonna miss Kevin Conroy. We're still missing the guy. Voice of Batman. We're gonna miss him like we're missing Rick May for um the soldier and his iconic roles in Star Fox. Yeah, nineties animated voice actor. Kevin Conroy. Yeah. It's why the actor that played Luke Skywalker will never play the Joker again. He said if Kevin Conroy is no longer around to play Batman, he's never going to be the Joker again. Yeah, he died. I don't understand how he died. I can't remember how he died, actually. That's how I should put it. But if somebody knows in chat, like, put it in chat so Joey can know. Because I forgot how he passed away. Guy was an iconic actor, like level fives. Oh, we got a fresh deer. Deer meat. Yep. Yes, I shot you in the face and I have no regrets. Save the chicken. Yeah, chicken shaved, saved. No, it's not. Yes, it is. I killed it before they killed him. <laughs> but I will save this little ice cat. Nope. <laughs> like when you save them like that, they're automatically put in your inventory. <laughs> Dead cat. Oh, there's one of them left. Hey there, bitch. Dead bitch. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, he was just picking apart that body for a little all munchy munch. Despite I, the differences between Power World and Pokemon, like Power World, Palmon are a lot more brutal than Pokemon. Yeah. Especially when there's a dead body around and they just start feasting on it. Yeah. You don't see that in Pokemon. Joey's a big Pokemon fan. I used to be Pokemon, but I just really can't enjoy playing the game anymore. Everything's just 
rinse and repeat with Pokemon for me. I don't know about you cadets out there, but for me, Pokemon's just like been rinse and repeat the same thing for literal years. Even the card games like rinse and repeat, and I used to collect it. I didn't mean to do that. Mess here. That. That. Put that. Put that. That. Sort. Put the arrows in the. Uh, on the ammo crates over here. Nope. Oh, we do got to put those in there. Put those in there. Nope. Nope. Okay, there's the arrows. Yeah, let's go cook some saucy food. Mmm. Hamburger cheese, er, 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 french fry, uh, steak. Ah. Uh. Hold on. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, <laughs> oh, fired prematurely. At least my house is still standing. Keep ah! Okay, I'm switching out the rocket launcher. There. I don't need to fire prematurely anymore. I'm a ninny. I'm still getting used to this new controller. Nintendo controllers are so tricky. Cadets, I hate. No! Stop firing prematurely, you asshole! I know, right? <laughs> Why? Why do I keep firing prematurely, cadets? Why keep everything? Ah! I don't know why I'm doing this, but it's hilarious. My pain is hilarious sometimes when I do that. Yeah, we're gonna have a gonna need a different box for the eggs now. Not ready to hatch these things yet. Okay, so just fed. You. Put the chicken over here. Roast pork. Memory steak. Don't eat it, just waste it. No, I'm not uh-uh eating it. I'm putting it in my food bag. For travels. Oh, You're a ninny. I don't need to climb a wall like Spider-Man right now. 
Everybody does a base differently, but I like mine with a little, like, style and finesse. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to do a lot more, like, that's bad. We're gonna have to go up to the greenhouse here in a minute. On top of the house. To get some of that ooze ingredients. So we make more food. But, uh, anyway, is cadets. I hope y'all are having a wonderful time wherever y'all are on the planet Earth in the Milky Way galaxy. Obviously, me and Joey here, we just woke up from, um, obviously our shift. And we're actually doing pretty well. Let's see her hold the harvest. And then get the red berries. You gotta love just having a thing like a greenhouse on top of the house. It's actually pretty sweet. I know, right? I mean, I made this just to have uh, this up here, like, I was wondering when Power World but, uh, had all these plants, are they ever going to make, like, glass windows and stuff like this? Yeah. So, a greenhouse could be built. And, lo and behold, they did it with the Shokuma update, and I freaking love it. So, yeah. Freaking awesome. Like, the lettuce patch takes a while. Gonna, hold on. Gonna bring out Phantom Rose to help me harvest. I actually love playing this game. And I'll probably continue love playing it for a long time, because, like, It's just one of these iconic games that you're going to be playing for a long time if you get into it. I absolutely adore this game. But a lot of y'all are probably like wondering like, is it ever going to replace something like Pokemon? Is Power World ever going to replace that game? And in the long run, no. I don't think Power World will ever replace Pokemon. I think it's going to be a top tier competitor against Pokemon, but nothing more, nothing less. It's just going to be a competitor. That's what I'm going to love about it. It's just going to be a competitor. Going to keep Pokemon up on their toes. And rightfully so. I'm actually looking forward to that. Because despite Power World's like massive success. Like, this is definitely going to put Nintendo oh, on, like, trying to make a proper Pokemon game with less bugs and all that. And I guess that's kind of the reason why Pal World was made. You know, these guys were tired of Nintendo coming up with mediocre, like, Pokemon games, so they made their own. To rival Nintendo's, and now Nintendo's going to have to be like, oh, this game's beating ours, we're going to have to do something, like, to literally... Restore the faith in the Pokemon fan base of this is what they're going towards. And that's what I like to think. Like, Power World was made in a retaliation to Nintendo's failures. 
And now Nintendo's gonna be like, yeah, we gotta level up our game. And that's actually a good thing. Like, friendly rival competitor and competitors like this can end up innovating the game companies to make better choices. Or just companies in general. You gotta love that. I mean, despite, like, you know, a lot of people throwing shade at this game, there's not really much comparisons to Nintendo's Pokemon compared to Power World. They're two entirely different games. While Pokemon's more limited in their overall, like, gaming, exp gaming capabilities, Power World is more of an open sandbox. You know, you can build fortresses, you can capture Palmon, you can make equipment, all that kind of stuff, weapons, all that. Actually a really good concept of an idea. There's nothing truly horrible about Pow World, and there's not a lot of similarities to Pokemon compared to Pow World. There is some, but there's too many differences to say it's a straight up clone. It's not. It's its own entity. Like, when I go over to, like, my locals and stuff, talk with some of the guys about Power World, they say, like, oh, how it's almost a complete copy of, like, Pokemon. And that means they obviously never played it and see what it's actually like. You know, they've never played the game for themselves, and it really does show how incapable they are of Telling the difference between the two. It's weird. You know? And it's a bit disrespectful to Pal World. And Pokemon to compare the two the way they do. Nothing too similar about them. They're their own complete different entities. And the sooner you accept that, the better. Still trying to figure out the uh, feels for this new controller. Oy vey. Now let me get that wheat out of the fridge. Cause like, no, oh, we should be able to make a whole bunch of like flour. Yep. Okay, there we go. I mean to do a barrel roll. Come on. Gonna have to get uh Luna uh uh Lisa of uh, the power computer to grind up this wheat. Not what I meant to do. Pain suffering. Why do I do this to myself? Lapa, I called her Lapa.
Do Zappa. Put cooler in there. Switch it out with Zappa. There we go. Twenty eight flower. I really got to arrange an A team and a B team in the near future. Yeah, you guys are hungry. I see that. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Obviously, I want to see new recipes in their future, too. Maybe they'll jump on, on that on next update. Right now, what I understand with the developers of Power World, uh, I seem to understand they're still writing off the success of this update while still doing, like, contests. I'm like, ain't nothing bad with that. It just... Feels like they should put their time in by like, developing the next update. Or maybe they are, like, I don't know. Get to get, uh, do more cooking. Okay, now I'm getting used to controls for the cooking. That's good, Mike. Holy crud. The con Nintendo, oh, like, Switch controllers are weird. I think I'll post the new equipment I got on on like Twitter later. Just to give y'all like a feel for like what I'm working with here. I think y'all are gonna be like quite surprised, like what the fuck? Where'd he get this weird ass shit? <laughs> More likely, he's gonna be the response from you people. Y'all gonna be like, eh? okay? There we go. Meanwhile, let's put this out there for them so they can have something to eat. Yeah, that mushroom soup ain't doing much for them. Are you stuck, pal? Yeah, you stuck, aren't you? Got stuck playing. There you go. Get your munchies in. Get your munchies in. Do some shopping.
Yeah, let's see, I can get some milk. Egg. Lay off the berries, right? We can just grow those in the greenhouse. I guess I should make a second layer to the greenhouse. I think I'll do that here today. If I got enough ingredients for and uh like items for it. All right, so we can make a couple of those. Pancakes! We're gonna make some pancakes for them. Who doesn't love pancakes in the morning? Sometimes I just love going to the International House of Pancakes. Or at least the International Galactic House of Pancakes. Okay. What? <laughs> You're a waffle guy, not a pancake guy? Well, I'm more of a pancake guy, but I'll just... Yeah. 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 Can I fuck the dragon? I want to fuck the dragon. Yeah, I know, right? And especially since, oh, now there's been like a new Shrek movie confirmed being made for next year. Or is it in two years? I can't remember. Yeah, they're making a new Shrek movie. Shrek's coming back. I mean... I'm not against it, but the way, like, Disney's looking right now, and the world, like, nobody's gonna really care, because Disney's got this horrible image now. Not only that, but they're being sued by Elon Musk, and, like, all these people are jumping on the bandwagon. How the heck you get in my house?! Probably now this guy can't freaking teleport. <laughs> or can it? <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> You're supposed to be out there, not in here. What if it by the time you get back in there? Oh, he better not be. Nah, this is my personal quarters. Like, fuck that shit. <laughs> now I'm gonna put him back in the power box if he does it again. Like, what the heck? Now that's a glitch and a half. I thought they fixed that problem. Ah, hey, he's laying down. Yeah, he he's 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 sleepy. He's sleepy. He, just, he needs some rest. He's a sleepy boy. Maybe he just just him early and have the nap. Nope, that's not okay. Now the master bedroom's the master bedroom it belongs to the master. Like what the fuck? Not okay, cadets. Not okay. When your Palmon start taking over the house, you know, you gotta enforce the laws.
Okay, so build consecutively. Put a second layer to the greenhouse. Make more ingredients. Heck yeah. Love that idea. All right. I guess we need to put some lights here too, obviously for like. Proper er uh, foliage because last thing we want to do is like from right. Aesthetically, I want it to look kind of pleasing. Where it makes sense, but it looks kind of cool. Gonna have to make some more bars for some more lights. That ain't no big deal. Make some more metal bronze bars. So down here we'll have the uh, first we'll harvest these. So we're gonna have the uh, uh no wait a minute. We're gonna have the hard stuff grow down here, obviously, the wheat eat and the uh berries will be on the top level. Because, like, those are easy to grow, right? Harvest the berries. So, we'll disassemble these. Or better yet, hold on. So we'll have berries and tomatoes down here, obviously. And we'll have lettuce and wheat on the upper floor. As like, one of them's like obviously veggies and the other ones are fruit. So we might as well have them organized. In such a fashion, you know? I think that would be better off and it makes more sense. Of course, Joey's going to be like here in a second. Who cares about sense? It's food. It's food. Oh, I actually agree. Oh, you actually agree with that one? Okay, good. Yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, we need more tomato seeds. What we can do is make some more berry plantations over here. We're going to have to go hunting for some. To now we can buy some, actually.
No, I was expecting insubordination out of you again. Yeah, you. What, what did I do today? Not today. You know what you did the other day. Okay. Right now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna harvest these tomatoes. And we're gonna rebuild them further down the line. Then, and what we're gonna do is make a few more berry patches. And we're gonna have four things of tomatoes. We're gonna have about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things of berry patches. As we want a pretty healthy spread of ingredients in the greenhouse. Now I'll get Alpha 5 out of here to help us, like, build. Berry patches. I mean, Alpha 7. Okay, there we go. Now what we need to do... Is... Once I... There we go. We climb upstairs. Go up there. Do a little bit of property damage. Don't worry, kiddos. We're going to repair the property damage. As soon as I choose it.
love doing renovations on the time. Thanks. Love to see it. Love to see it. Now what we're going to do, we're going to make a couple of wheat plantations. It lines up. Maybe I have a bit of autism, but I do anything. I kind of like things pairing up pretty well, like this. Not perfectly, but good enough. All right, now what we need is lettuce plantation. Almost done here. We're going to build two more lettuce plantations, but I'm going to have to do a bit of a change to the greenhouse's itinerary a bit. From over here. We're going to be adding a new part. Oh, all right. Now what we need to do. Property damage.
Parking area. Area. Okay. Right. Oh. Okay, I think I got I was in my mouth out. You can answer, there's always a reason for my madness. Always some feeling of genius. If not an absolute insanity. So right now we need to get some more wood. And we need to make some more steel ignigates. Ask and we shall receive. Okay, right now what we need to do make a couple of these. We're gonna make a hundred and twenty. River, get the cooking boy. Look at him go. All right, we need to go back up top. Make the other two wheat plantations.
So we got the four wheat fields. We got four. Uh, uh, I mean, woo, 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 woo. Didn't need wheat. What we needed was uh, lettuce. Oh, uh, you know what? For EXP when we did that anyways. All right, there we go. There we go. We got the wheat. Time for our, our lettuce. Once we get a little bit more tomato seeds, we'll put the tomato feet, the last two tomato fields. Let's complete the rest of the lighting. Gonna need nails too. That means we're gonna need more of these. River, get the cooking again. Get them making these nails. Get Alpha 7 to help me with the nails. Good boy, Alpha. What I meant to happen. So you see, I don't want to be in the camera. Going up. Rest of these ring right e lamps done. Right here. We're gonna have to make two more on the top up level. But it'll be more than worth it. We'll buy some tomato seeds here in a second. All right.
We'll start our planting the ingredients afterwards. Wonder, do I have it? I, I do not. Hold on. I think I actually get that now. Yeah, I can. <laughs> Want to get one more item? Freaking sweet. Traffic light. Traffic light. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Now, I'm gonna put that in the bedroom just because... Hold on. Can I turn this thing around? I can't. I'm gonna line it. I can't turn it around. That sucks. Now we're gonna put the hanging X sign. Build it, build it, build it.
trying to align it. Not exactly. You know what? Close enough. That's a little genius I am. <laughs> signs everywhere. All right. So now what I got to do is... Nope. Go over to the local village. No, not that one. God dang it. Christ's sakes of all harm, it's anger. I really don't like this new Nintendo Switch controller and like how all the controls are switched around because of it. Yeah, I know, right? Like the... <laughs> Maybe, I don't know at this point. Talk to him. Talk to him. Bye. Uh, that's only enough for one tomato patch. Bye. We go over to sell. That's here. But... Now that's one gold. Oh, I know that's worth a thousand right there. So, I guess we can sell some of the wheat seeds. That's 60. Not that I fence pinned it to. That's too good. Yes, 500. I'll get you. Over by. And the seeds, because, like, I think we're going to need four more. Oh, supply drop! Let's go over why this supply drop. Oh, it's not going to be too far away either. I love these things. Like, I still don't know how these supply drops are dropped off. But uh, this is why we need lore on how these things drop off, you know? 
Like, I get the meteors from from space, but what about the supply drops? You guys are out of shape. I tell you what. Yeah, because it noticed me. Like, it heard the sound and, it like, it's going, like, what the hell is going on? It's like, I don't know what's going on anymore. Like, what the heck's going on over there? That's what was going through its head. Ooh, burning it. Oh, we all be able to carry more. Heck yeah. Let's see how we can carry three one thousand three hundred weight. Love it. Absolutely love it. All right, now we're going to go back to base. Go back up to the greenhouse. I said back up there, not back down. Oi, way. So the only one up there is firework. Grappling gun, yeah, like I pressed the wrong freaking command and decided, you know what? Just to press the wrong command, I'm just gonna have you fall down back down there. That makes it hard for Yeah. Yeah. And we need more wood, and we need powerful wood. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, you know what that means, kids. You gotta go murder some water palmon. <laughs> gotta go to a water area and murder some water palmon. There is any at night. We're going to take a nap, and then we're going to go uh, water hunting in the morning. Ah, nice and white like a spring chicken. Let's go murder some Palmon. Time to get the old shoddy out. Thank you for your generous donation. We'll take some of those too. He's running for his life. <laughs> yeah, because he knows that he has something I want. <laughs> he knows he also doesn't share the tips. Yeah, get back here!
And those things can actually carry around submachine guns. Yep, they can wield submachine guns, but you need to be careful because according to the power decks, like, it's gonna mine them a child, so as soon as it's got one of those, like, it's gonna freaking kill you if you're not too nice to it. <laughs> so it's got a mind of a child, but I can wield a machine gun. Take that as you will. Kind of like me with a shotgun right now. <laughs> You're very Yes. I didn't like this. I just killed Dumbos. Oh, no, that out Thundercock's getting that underway at the uh, base. Right now, we're just getting power fluids. Basically, just killing for water. Fine. Yep. <laughs> That's so good. Yeah, it starts lost in the ocean. Be getting those power fluids anytime soon. Oh, they actually. Yep. Thank blasted shotgun range. <laughs> Chicken egg. We take those. Yeah, joy sometimes has an age of all problems, everyone. Yeah. Plus, allergy season really doesn't help them with it either. Like, galactic allergy season's a bitch. Yes, there is allergies in space. <laughs> now, eventually, like, somebody's gonna, uh, one day look at these streams and, wait a minute, there's no allergies in space. That doesn't make sense. And I'm like, Pfft. doesn't have to make sense to make the funny. As soon as you make sense out of funny, you take all the fun out of funny. So what's the problem with people these days? Like, they need an explanation for everything. Because they don't understand what comedy is. And it ends, t ends up taking off people like me because... People don't understand comedy anymore. And somebody's literally got to explain what emotions and funny is. Wrong in this world. Everybody needs an explanation for just about everything. Nobody can think for themselves or literally have a good time. Oh, 
like everybody needs like explanation that or explanation this or like tell me about that or like <laughs> you know, freaking up the walls why people can't think for themselves or just enjoy comedy. I blame the school systems. Oh, more than are ways than you think. More than more, and more ways than you think, my friend. The education of planet Earth is so freaking redundant. Why do I gotta explain everything to these freaking brats? I'm not a teacher. I'm an entertainer. There's a difference. When, and I gotta explain everything to them. It drives me up the freaking wall. I'm not a teacher. Damn it. Yeah, oh, this is me. Oh, there, yeah. Y'all literally want to learn, read a book. get any e like 50 wood for one more that sounded wrong in my head Fuck it, collateral damage. <laughs> I'm being lazy. <laughs> Blow up everything. Oh. Yep. I just murderized all of them. Yay, laziness and collateral damage. <laughs> Blow up everything! <laughs> okay, Mr. Nah, I'm Grenade Man! Blow up everything! Joey's never played Babe and a. He probably doesn't even understand. <laughs> That's a glitch and a half, poor monkey! Not you okay there, monkey? Seems like you're having a seizure there, pal! <laughs> Oh, that poor little critter. Oh, God. You see, it's sudden little, like, accidents like that that makes it worthwhile just playing Power World. Oopsies. <laughs> Gotta fix that code later. <laughs> Looked like he was humping the earth. What do you think?
Okay. Now we can get a water pal on. But first, let's get the plant. Well, I guess we should get the water pal on because we don't have enough power fluids to do it by hand. So, oh. Ow, take a little fall damage. It's but a scorch. Alright, so oh, never mind. We got Lapa. Of course we're okay. Lee. <laughs> All right, Rose, let's get to work. The Phantom Rose. Yeah, it does. It's its animation when it's planting stuff. Phantom Rose must be handling stuff upstairs. Knew it. Yep. Once all this ingredient starts growing. After we all get it watered and like we do a little bit of cooking. Right then and there, I think we'll call it a stream. For this morning. Just because obviously like. Got a little bit of fourth dimension oh, existence and responsibilities to do. And we'll be back. I'll be back Monday, of course. But Sunday, there will be a new schedule coming up with a new time where you can catch my streams because, like, early in the morning really doesn't catch like a lot of people's eyes there's a lot of people who gotta work during like the mornings and all that I'm gonna try to be aiming for more around like two o'clock maybe three o'clock in the morning I mean not two o'clock or three o'clock in the morning but in the afternoon uh, going to like five or six in the afternoon Sometimes, like Thursdays and Fridays, there will be no streams, though, as I have hobbies I have to focus on sometimes. From Dungeons and Dragons to, like, until I completely get out of Yu-Gi-Oh! the card game. I'm doing that a little bit at a time. 
Sometimes it's not fast enough, but I do what I can as fast as I can. This greenhouse is actually coming along a lot more better than what it once was. I'm actually pretty proud of that. Because now we got a whole vegetable section and a whole fruit section. So now all we got to do is focus on like getting a whole bunch of meats and probably make a like cold cooler section of the like base to keep the meats cold where we don't have to rely like a, on a ice palm on to constantly keep it cold. So like a couple of uh, old cold generators. And, uh, we'll probably keep cooler at the base to keep everything cool in, like, the freezer area as well, just in case. That'll be interesting. So we'll have a giant fire palmon, we'll have an ice palmon, and we'll have an electric palmon keeping everything up. Uh, next week we'll try to get at that new generator that I unlocked up and running. So, like, the two smaller generators could be replaced with, like, a bigger generator that has more electrical output and charging. Papa is literally watering downstairs. That's good. I just see a lot of water Mm hmm. Yeah, she's focusing downstairs like this. Got one more. So we're gonna have everything watered. Gonna have to reach out and touch a game store today about some business. All right, there we go. We got all the grow. I love it. <laughs> the weeds already rooted. <laughs> Oh, we can make a couple of these. No! That was my last rocket, too. That was my last bloody rocket. Why? Why? Why do I gotta blow up things all the time? Why? Why I gotta blow up things all the time like that irresponsibly? No, those are supposed to be reviews responsible, not irresponsible. God dang it, Commander. Why are you such a freaking retard sometimes? Why am I like this? Why? I tell you why, because it's freaking hilarious. Ah. No! I wasted my last rocket. I'm not okay. I'm upset. <laughs> That's meant to be wasted on the enemy, not my fortress. 
Hogwarts had an animation with that in the first place. And then that happened. Yeah, that does happen. <laughs> it's just like, oh, the stuff has health. Yeah. <laughs> Not funny. Yeah, boy, you got four compartments. Yeah. No bullets are not supposed to stay cold. Yes, they are. Not unless you're from New York. I'm not from New York. We don't keep bullets cold here in the South. We keep them safe and warm. And our guns. Put your bullets in your guns in the fridge. Just never put them in the stove. <laughs> That's the last thing you want to do. Worst thing you could ever do is put your bullets in the stove. Don't worry, you're an immortal object. You'll... No, nah, I'm not an immortal in this game. I'll just come back, pay Eve, and with all my equipment and left where I once, like, off myself. Exactly. You're an immortal. You'll come back. You, uh, it'll be easy. And you wonder why I have a twitch in my eye with Ed Joey sometimes. Not like you gotta actually battle for you. But you just... Alright, yeah, that one full. Cool. Okay, there. My Palmon should be at least happy for a while. Like full freaking bellies. Oh! But we don't have any food. Yeah, we'll, we'll take the. We'll all take the marinated mushrooms because, like, they don't do much for, like, health. There we go. Like, I wonder how long it'll take for, like, that generator to be built now. Like, hold on, let me find large power generator. All right, we need... Wow, it's going to take a lot of palladium um, metal ignigants and electric organs. Yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to have to do some serious grinding before we can get that up and running. Wow. Well, I'm just saying, this is supposed to, like, replace at least two, maybe four of the, like, those regular generators right here with power capacity. So, that's nice. And, like, this makes it easier for, like, power to be put in there on the Palmon. Makes it easier for them. Where they don't have to expend, like, so much energy to do it. But, yeah. And we're probably going to add some street lights here at the base. Like, next live stream, some uh, street lamps. I'm just going to have to do a lot of grinding for electric organs and, uh, you know, get some stuff to make the palladium ignigates for the generator. Thank you all so much for joining me and Joey for, like, this kind of early live stream, like, what time is it? Like, what the freak? Oh, uh, yeah, tw uh, 12.20. So, like, next time when, and we come back, we're planning to make the new generator. We're going to put some street lights across the base. Here today, we took down the corrupt police officer or organization, the PDF. 
We also edited the greenhouse a bit. It made it a lot more like green. That's how I'm gonna put it. And through and through. Join us next time, next week, obviously. I think I'm gonna start streaming around two, maybe three PM US Central Time. Stay tuned to Twitter slash X or the Discord or YouTube when the new stream schedule is announced. I'm gonna be streaming for at least three or four hours from here on out on the gameplay stuff. As I will also start our very soon playing RE3 along with RE4. Once I figure out how to properly adjust the um flash and the new uh recording card, obviously. That thing is going to allow me to continue to play a Rebirth efficiently. But until then, we're going to be playing uh, Ever Crisis and Final Fantasy VIII uh, Remastered. We're also going to be playing Mega Man and Metal Slug games for a little while. The Metal Slug franchise. As, yeah, obviously, I got a ton of games I still want to play and like, Sometimes we'll play Deep Rock Galactic. Sometimes we'll play, like, Apex Legends, obviously, or Uno. You know, I got a lot of games that I just love to play. And I know y'all here when you see The Commanded, or y'all want to see me play video games. And I want to be that, like, variety game streamer, of course. So thank y'all so much. And, wow, that's a glitch in the graphics. But despite all this, thank y'all so much. I've been the commander, and I am Billy Rambo. And we were glad to entertain y'all today. Until next time, I am cutting off transmission. And I literally gotta log out of the game first. Ah! Not one minute. Get back in the ball! Return to the title. Thank y'all so much. Hopefully next time I'll have Joey Rimbo's ball all set up. And my face just froze. That was very funny. Uh, thank y'all so much. We are outie. Later.